So boom guys, in this video, we're gonna be opening up a full display of the Crown Zenith mini tins. So there's 10 mini tins in here. I'm just gonna show you the pack art. And basically as all mini tins, they usually come with two packs. And we're gonna see from 10 tins, what are the pull rates? You got five different designs. And if you put them all together, it will make this picture here. All right, but let's crack this open and let's see what we can get. So I need to take a thumbnail. So I didn't cut anything. So boom. So boom, boom. Obviously, we want to use the Charizard one for the thumbnail. So boom, that should be enough picks for the thumbnail. But as you can see, we have multiple different designs, and I think we should just get into it and start opening these one by one and showing you the designs that way. Uh, so we're gonna start off with the Charizard one for some good luck. Uh, so that was a hot, so hard to open, but yeah. 10 mini tins in this video so as you can see we get two packs of crown zenith and no more art cards no more art cards so two crown zeniths and one sticker pack let me do another one and just confirm that we're not getting those that they were promised or being that was selling okay this one did okay the charizard just didn't have it but as you can see you get an art card and the sticker sheet oh you get the sticker off the character you get always oh, a pain to peel these off well, there you go you just get a sticker there but for some reason the charizard one was missing so i'll just put that aside just to confirm that they do come with some but yeah just that charizard one was just missing it will open the other chair there's two of each design in the display five of five designs two of each uh but yeah let's get into it so it's 20 packs so we go straight to the rare maybe later down the video but boom let's go like this one two three four all right let's go let's go let's see what we can get guys Come on, hopefully we can get some bangers today. Uh, but yeah, Mr. Mime sunk. Okay, big barrel, and we got a Sky Seal Stone. So size Sky Seal Stone Hollow. So double whammy in that one. Yeah, I always feel like the mini tins have great pull rates. Pokemon Go, even Celebration mini tins. I pulled so many bangers out the Celebration mini tins. Um, so yeah, let's see what we got here. So boom, code card for from the back. So let's see if we can get double whammy again. And see how many hits we get in per. Um, but yeah, let's go. Let's go. So these are a great buy if you're bored just going into the shop You can just pick up a little tin for 10 pounds two packs there, but oh nothing there So yeah one uh, two hits in that one from one and then this one we've already cracked to show you the stickers and card um, But I'll show you the back of the card So that is the card there and that just gives you um, Information about the Pokemon not so much the trainer that's featured in there. So that is that one All right, let's go. Let's go so Boom, tin number two now. Let's we'll see if we can get guys best of luck on the pools. We've got Salandit, Perline, Grubbin, Skrelp, Heliopatil, Shinx, and a full art energy. So this is not the reverse one, this is the full art one here. And then boom. I think we'll go straight to the rare, but I'm seeing something here. But we'll go straight to the rare Zora Arc and Calyrex. So that's two full arts in that tin if you do count the energy. A Zorak V Star along with a Calyrex Hollow. So, yo, not bad, not bad. On to the next design, which is Sonya. Am I right to say Son Sonya? So, boom. So, yeah, this one does come with card and sticker. So, there's the sticker there. And you got the art card with the Yamper on it. And two packs. So yeah, let's go, let's go, let's see what we can get. So we're gonna go straight to the red, just because obviously this video is gonna be super long if we don't. But we've got a Kyoga V here. Kyoga V, just because obviously I'm showing you the tins, the design, the art cards, the stickers. So should be enough time to get eight minutes in there. You know how it is, guys. But boom, okay, Deoxys and Raihan. So boom, I'm still, I need a lot of cards for my collection, mainly gold and a few of the full art SARs. Uh, but th that was three hits in two there. Now we got Hop. We got Hop with the Wulu. So, boom. As you can see, we've got the Wulu stats there. And then we got the sticker as well. Got two packs in that one. So, so far, we're averaging about two to three hits a tin, which is a good pull rate. So, buying one of these tins, we shouldn't miss out. Hopefully, let's see for the rest of the case. So, that one had no hits. If we don't get a hit, a hit here, then. That means oh, I spoke too soon. But oh, come on. All right, just a one hit. Imagine we got the hop hollow in the hop tin. 
what's the odds of that one? Let's go. Hop hollow there. And then we've got the Marnie one. So Marnie with the more Peko. So yeah, it was so odd that we didn't get it in the Charizard tin, any stickers. And then we'll open the other Charizard tin and see. We've got the Marnie hot sticker there. And art cart boom. So we've got those two packs. And the art cards here, just give you a look at that. We've got the more Peko stats on the back. But you can pause and read it, obviously. Um, we're just going through it quickly. But yeah, let's go. Let's see if we can get here. Any more SAR so far? One SAR. Uh, but boom, Perlines, Lycan Rock. Or full art glaring Dario Ultra S. Uh, but yeah, come on. Second one. Please be no, no hit. Okay, Arialu. So again, one hit. So that is half the box. That's one of each design opened. And now we're going to open another one of each design on the second half. I'm going to start with the Cherizard one. Um, just to make see if it's true that we're getting no sticker. Okay, well, thankfully we got a sticker. Because I would love the Cherizard and Leon sticker to stick on something. One of my computers or something like that. So we got that. Then we got the art card with the Cherizard on here. If these were gradable, it would be so insane. But they're just a bit odd sized. It should be TCG size. That would be nice. Because otherwise, where can you store them? You can't put them in a binder. You can't sleeve them up. Could put them in semi-rigid without a sleeve maybe. But apart from that, it's... I don't know, but yeah, does PS maybe PSA does grade them? We'll see. But yeah, come on, let's go. Okay, we've got Simi Sir V Star here. Simi Sir V Star. So one hit so far, and then the second one. Ooh, we got an SAR again. Drapion V uh, Full Art Glaring Gallery. So boom, we'll take that Drapion V. Not the probably the best one to get, but yo, two hits there, not too bad. Uh, but let's see what we can get in next one which is uh marnie so but i'm keeping all the stickers i'm leaving the cards in there though but yeah, i'll show you this, all the stickers now in the cards so we'll just get into the packs so this is one tim got hit straight away iridar full oh, let's go i don't even know the value on this i know the japanese is super expensive i don't know what the english price is saying but i feel like it's one of them ones i want to grade maybe so we'll get that graded why not so I think I've got one in my collection, but we'll get that one graded nonetheless. Let's go. Come on, another one here. Ooh, double whammy. So three hits in there with the Soul Rock and the Hop Hollow. So decent pull rates. So far, these tins haven't let us down. We managed to get at least one hit in each. I'm hoping we can get a tin with two double whammies. So two, two hits in each pack. That'd be epic. But boom, we got the Hop Tin now. All right, starting off with the first pack. We've got something. Oh, just see me see a V start again. So let's go, let's go. Next one. we got a Wooly for Hop. But what's the hit going to be? Okay, we got two hits there with a Hatron V here. So it's been two hits in that mini tin. All right, we got Sonya. Um, sticker pack, take that out. Yeah, who else loves mini tins? Just a little fun rip. And so far, it hasn't let us down. We've given us zero hits in one tin. So these are, would be a good buy. Obviously, I might be lucky. You could get unlucky and get zero hits, which can happen at times. But so far, from a whole display of these, we've not missed out. As you can see, we've got the Greed and V in this one. And the next one. Oh, Lux Ray and Double. So, boom. That was one hit in there. We've got the last one now. we got the BD Tin. So boom. Taking all them stickers there. Yeah, let's go. So, that would be all the tins. And these are final two now. So, yeah. So, I pick up the pace to go straight to rare. Let me know what you prefer. Taking it slow or straight to the rare openings. But, let's see what we got. Okay. Zero Aura V-Star. So again, we managed to get a hit in every single one of these tins today, which isn't a bad result. But then final one here, let's go. Oh, we've got full art here to end it off. What could it be? What do I need from this set? Sweet Coon V, that is a good one to end it off in. One of my favorite full art V SARs you can get. The Sweet Coon V, so that's definitely going in the green pile. But that is the tins today. So that was 20 booster packs. Should I count up how many hits so we can work out an average? But well, this feels like it's going to be a good average. So I just counted up. We got 20 hits out of 
20 packs obviously some packs having double whammies but the pull rates are really really good i feel in these mini tins so definitely worth grabbing uh for it uh, to open guys and yeah we're gonna have some of these available on famouscrow.com as well as packs and some of these tins and we only got limited stock for the first round but i think there is going to be more uh, stock of these later down the line so hit the link in the description guys grab your tins and packs for the box breaks or you can order them sealed on our website as well so grab them asap i'll put the link in the descriptions but yeah not a bad pull rate at all guys like subscribe and i'll catch you in the next one peace <laughs>